Good evening, ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls. Tonight we're live at the Talbot Brink with the Gloucester Fishermen take on the Lutfield Pioneers. Off the faceoff. They try to get it back to the point they can't. It comes to the near boards, and EJ Field keeps it in. He's got time. Over to Costanzo, down low to Abreu. Abreu shot. Goes high and wide. Abreu with it. Back up high to Costanzo. Makes a nice move. Shot. Deflected wide. He goes in after it. Gets his own rebound. Swings it up high. Drops it off the field. Field. Shot. Score! That was a screenshot. Nobody saw. EJ Field makes it 1 0 Gloucester. Good defensive play there by Linfield. And here come the Pioneers. Broken up by Costanzo. It's, no, it, okay, he stayed on side. Field with it. Gets it back to Costanzo. Costanzo tries to get it to the middle. Shot. Field score! EJ Field. He finds himself in the right place at the right time. 2 0 Gloucester. But Linfield has possession. Here come the Pioneers. They got something brewing here. They get it down low. Up high. Shot. Score! What a shot that was. Daniel Mack. Off the post. Top corner. 2-1 to one Gloucester. Shot on goal. Saved by Vatians. Linfield with it. Shot blocked by Liberal. And it goes back behind the Gloucester net again where Freddy's is. Up to the far boards. No one's there. Shot. Save Vatians. And right now all the zone time is favoring Linfield in the early part of the second period. Field steals it. Looking for a hat trick. He's got Costanzo. Score! EJ Field. He found his buddy Jack Costanzo right in front. And the fishermen take a 3 0 lead. A 3 1 lead. Here comes Field. What a nice play by Costanzo. Here comes, here comes EJ. He's looking for. He's got Morris. Shot. Save. But he gets it outside the zone. Here come the Pioneers. Nice move there, shot. Save, it's hands, number 24. They still got a half a minute to go on the power play. They get it in the zone. Shot, deflected wide, rebound, it's a goal! The puck came off the other backboards and one of the Linfield players was sitting right there to knock it home. Number 23, John Simonetti. And Linfield controls the draw. Up high, a brew keeps it in, gets it over to field, field, shot, deflected, what a play, goal by Jack Delaney. And what a pass by EJ Field, instead of taking a slap shot, he saw Delaney at the side of the net and he made a nice pass over to him and Jack Delaney tips it in for the goal, 4-2 to two Fisherman on the power play. Frades, Schuster. Linfield has it behind the net. They pull the goalie now. Now they do with two minutes left. Score! I think it was number 15, Nathan Alves. Right through the wickets. It's 4-3 to three as soon as they went to pull the goalie. So that maybe they wouldn't mind walking away here with a tie. Off the face off, he wins it. He gets it back, it's blocked. Shot by Simonetti, saved by Vitsians. I don't think he saw that coming. He just stuck his glove up and it went in it. Shot, blocked by Costanzo, but they keep it in. Out front, Simonetti, shot, off the post! Oh, they caught a huge break there. Linfield scrambling all over the place. Simonetti had a chance to tie the game and he hits the post and Vatans ties it up with 1.9 seconds remaining. Costanzo wins the draw and that's the game. Oh, and EJ Field 
just leveled. Oh boy, that could that could be bad. I hope they don't take any action on that. All right, so the fishermen win the game four to three. They will finish the season with 12 wins, five losses, and three ties. They should get a higher seed than Linfield. Uh, as far as the Division II North playoffs are concerned, the two teams will line up and shake hands. Got a good sportsmanship. We could see these two teams match up again. For my colleague, Jim Capillo, I'm Phil Nicastro. This has been KPM Live's coverage of Gloucester High School Hockey. Have a great night, everybody.